Hello everyone and welcome back to American Truck Simulator. Sure, we're in Australia, but you know what I mean. In today's video, we move some livestock trailers from me and Deda to Kuladi with a quick stop in Charlottesville to check out the sites. So many updates have come to Rob's Mod and it's now compatible with Australia map. Today's truck is SWR's T610 SAR. All links will be in the description. Let's go trucking down under. And here's our beautiful Kenworth T610 SAR. Let's go ahead and fire it up with this Packer uh, MX-13 engine in it. And here's the livestock trailer we're going to be using today to run up to Charlottesville, but it'll be empty. We have nothing on board. And welcome on inside this beautiful truck. I'm going to go ahead and push the uh, parking brake in there. There we go. Awesome. Like I said, everything will be linked in the description below if you want to check it out there. Let's roll the windows down so you can listen to this engine. How as we go through the gears here. Let's get her rolling here first. She is uh, a heavier set uh, of trailers, but we don't have any freight we can haul in this thing, so I'm not going to worry about it today. We're just going to have a nice drive here in the outback and have a good time. That's all we're going to do. Big thanks to Thrustmaster for sponsoring this video, as always, in the American Truck Sim series. If you would like to check out what I use, it's always linked in the description below, like I said, with everything else. Man, Rob has really, really made a difference on this map, and you're going to see something really, really, really cool that I teased in the beginning, and that is we are going to actually have... Australian traffic on the roads. Some moomoos over there. Hello, moomoos. Say hello to the moomoos. Um, yeah, I got the next level racing motion platform V3 running here, so I'm going to be getting tossed all over the place while we're driving today. And we are using Serial Black's awesome physics mod. Alright, we made it out here to the highway, and we have to be careful pulling out here because it's a really narrow spot here. And I see nobody come from that way. We got a truck coming from this way, and we'll see if it is one of the new ones that he added. And it looks like it is indeed, yep. Got the Mac happening there. Nobody come from that direction. Yep, we're good. All right, let's go ahead and get this thing on the road. All right, sweet. I'm gonna roll the windows up here so we can uh, get into action with some Outback trucking. Now remember, this map is absolutely massive. And uh, it doesn't seem like it's going to take that long. Okay, this guy wants to get around us. And I think it's a police car. I was going to let him around me, but, you know, he's going to get back in line. Okay. I know we're going slow right now, but we're getting up to speed. Hey, we leveled up. Look at that. Because I used the stonks. Look at this monster. Absolute behemoth, man. Yeah, that is definitely a cop behind us. All right, we're getting back up to speed. Going to seven low here. There we go. Got that 18 speed we're rocking today. Okay, buddy. He really wanted to get around us before we got down here, didn't he? But yeah, that's in miles per hour, 62. We're only at coming up on 50 now. <laughs> you can pull over and stop there if you'd like. We're not going to do that today. This map is absolutely beautiful, man. It's come such a long way. It really has. Really happy to see Rob's whole uh, vision coming to fruition, you know? Road subject to flooding. Well, we've done that before, haven't we? Sure have. We crossed a river, and it was crazy. 
Now, we're not doing that today because it would be a long road up that way. check out some new parts of the map that you've never seen before and Charlottesville is one of those finally we're about up to speed here so I was waiting for okay that's that's annoying I appreciate you telling me that I'm leveling up but I don't care and the thing is after I get a uh, a new profile rolling like this that's whenever I'll go back through and I'll turn off that mod so it doesn't keep leveling us up like crazy. So we got a uh, something riverboat camp coming up here soon. Now we're just about at speed now. See, they want us at 62 because, yeah, I have this in miles per hour, not in kilometers an hour, but. Big bump, big bump there. <laughs> And we got Snow's Place up here on the left. There's so much to explore, and we will be doing that. Now, I wanted to talk about the Australian uh, truck simulator that's coming out soon. It's looking really good. I have been following it. I am not under living under a rock. I have been living the GTA 6 trailer, though. My God. I've gone through that over and over again. And uh, I can share some of my findings with you guys. I found that uh, some of the stuff that we're seeing there um, in the trailer is from all over the place in Miami and Homestead. And uh, there's even some spots up in uh, Panama City they grabbed. And then uh, some other places around Florida. And Rockstar said we're going back to the state of Leonida, so not just Vice City. Uh, Port Gellhorn is going to be one of the biggest additions to the map and I think that's going to be amazing. Uh, the more I have dug into the trailer and the map, the more I have realized just how massive that map is going to be. It's going to blow your mind. I promise you that. Okay, thank you. We leveled up yet again. Don't care. I got some cars up here. That's our highest Jake setting too. Roll the windows down here so we can listen to this bad boy as we drive here in Australia. Beautiful truck by SWR. Loving it. Butts of kills. And man, it's just so much fun to drive these road trains around. It really is. What a difference it makes. We don't have anybody behind us that's uh, like stacked up traffic wise, so. And this cop wanted to get in front of us and now here, there he is, but uh, now he's stuck behind traffic, so. He didn't really get anywhere, did he? Not really. I had to turn my smooth, smoothness up on the track I are today so that I'll uh, not get thrown around constantly because I'm, get, I'm getting beat up with the chair, but. This is actually pretty smooth right here. I have no complaints whatsoever. Boy, this doesn't even look like the same map as last time. It really doesn't. These big bumps. Does not feel like the same thing. Yeah, I'm just gonna stick to this speed about right here. This is a good following distance to the, to the cop in front of us. I'm okay with that. But yeah, a lot of cool stuff happening, you know, and uh, I know some people are upset about the 2025 release of GTA 6, but honestly, it doesn't bother me in the slightest. I'm excited for it no matter what, one, but uh, two. It's not really two years we're gonna have to wait. It's more like one because they announced it so late in the year. So it may feel like it's going to take an eternity, but it won't. All right, so this is the new town. 
This is the biggest town in the map, I believe. Charlottesville. I've been to Cool Addy before, but uh, we're not going there today. Big bump, big bump. And we're going to make a right turn. Now, look at all these little spots here. It's so cool. We're going to make a, uh, a right turn here and check out the town. And then we're going to go up the other way. And we'll do some uh, outback trucking up there. So, yeah, we're making a right turn here, it looks like. Yes, we are indeed. Nobody's coming. It's going to be a bumpy road. Let's get all these bad boys on there. There we go. Make sure our entire road train clears back there. Barely did. Barely, barely. All right, now we're on a dirt road again. Let's put this thing into six low, so I have to hear a scream the entire way down the road. So you got a turn up here as well. This is the main area, it looks like. All right. Go in here, it looks like. Yeah. Well, you really gotta. You're gonna have a lot of room here for all this stuff. Especially for a big road train like this, so. Straighten it out right here. Yeah, we should be alright there. It's going right around that tree now. In the back. There we go. Yeah, we have a little spot up here on the right. It feels like we've been here before. Maybe we have. Maybe we have been here before, but it just looks so different, the map, you know? Oh my, I don't even know how you, can we even get in here with this? We're gonna try. We're gonna try to get in here with this trailer. Oh, hello. No need for that. Straighten it all the way out next to the fence here. It should make it, because that thing is pretty articulated. If we just keep going to the left, we might be all right. Yep, just don't hit the gate. We're fine. Let's go left. Yeah, we're going to be just fine. I mean, barely. That thing barely made it through there. <laughs> Holy crap, dude. Oh, shut up. All right, so we're in Charleville. And we'll have a look at the map here. And see what... Uh, if there's anything available for us here that we can check out. But I just don't think there is. But that's okay. I wanted to check this place out anyway. So here we are just outside of Charlottesville. So no, we turned in too early because A steals down here in the gas stations there. There's a plaster and suns here. But look at this. You have all of this. That's where we just came from was my and data there. So it was uh, not too long of a drive. But we're going to go explore this outback up that way and see what it's all about. But you can see it goes all the way out here. I mean, this is so much road. And then we can go all the way out to here. Uh, you got... Kambalda, you got Norseman, you got Salmon Gums, Fraser Range, Baladonia, Worldba, Worldba you got uh, Kayaguna, uh, I'm not going to say all these, Kokobidi, you got uh, Madeira, <laughs> Madeira, <laughs> Munzura Bila, <laughs> and uh, whatever that one is, and then you got Melbourne down here, and uh, Company, and go into there, there we go, got Icy Creek and some other ones here as well. So not a lot of road made out of this yet, but it will be eventually. But we have a lot of road here to check out for sure. No, nope, there's only one way in and one way out, and we found that out the hard way. So we we'll have to do it again. <laughs> I'm gonna roll up the windows on this one. I just wanted you to get the uh, the feel of driving a big behemoth like this, the sounds of it all. Yeah, I don't think there's anything we can do. I, I, I don't think there's any way out besides this way. Doesn't look like it. All right, I'm going to go all the way to the left. By this gate here. There we go. Don't hit the gate. We go all the way left here.
Alright, well, that wasn't so bad, I suppose. Thought I was spinning my tires there for a second. It felt like I was. This is where it gets really crazy here. We're gonna make the left here and then we're gonna go back up north and see what that road is all about. And that's what we're gonna do here next. So we have to snake this thing to the right. You really do have to use like all of the road when you have one of these bad boys set up on your truck. All right, we got nobody come from the right. We're good there. Nobody from the left. All right, it's the same thing as last time. Just gonna use all of this we can. All the way out to there. Jump for this tree. I think we'll be okay there. Turn that off. Stay all the way to the right. Oh yeah, it's coming out of there now. Yep, we're all good. It's so much fun, man. Let's get this thing up to speed. But yeah, very, very excited for the new Australian truck simulator that's coming. Oh man, this is a very bumpy road here. I have to slow down a little bit for this. Holy moly, that was bumpy. Um, and I saw them uh, showcasing their road train trucks, not just that old Mac that we saw before. And holy crap, is it cool. All right, this is all new. So we've seen that place before, but man, all the new foliage and stuff, it just looks so different. So this is a, a whole new area that's been added, this part of Charlottesville here. So we have to go check it out, right? We've got a gas station up here too. Do I have to get gas? No, I think we're still fine. Yeah, we're fine on that. Well, there's nothing out here, is there? I don't think so. All right, let's get back in our lane over here in case there's traffic, which I don't think there is. And let's check out this little, little town here. That's something up here on the left. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's just like a big scrap yard. That's really cool. And there's the gas station there. Yep. And that's where you can get a job here. We're just going to go all the way around here. That's cool. You got a uh, Australian looking police car there in the back. We got a super liner there. Soupy. Go around the corner here. <laughs> not so easy with this all right i did some exploring up there and a lot of those roads are not finished yet so i uh couldn't drive on them so we came down here to snow's place and we're gonna take this and then get back on the highway and head back west all right let's get back out on the road and up the speed now this is a cool road here because there's some uh narrow bridges you have to go across but we're almost here to Snow's place, and it's Ward River Boat Camp is the name of that. Don't mind that crap that keeps popping up for my XP. Not worried about it. And always, uh, always a to-do whenever you create a new profile. So with this particular mod, you have to have its own profile with its own map, basically selected instead of California base you would select the uh, Australian one all right we have to cross this right here oh this is fine I'm gonna go real fast and um, then you have to move over you know all your previous controls settings and all that stuff from the other one I wish they made a copy and paste that'd be really nice if SES would make a copy and paste on that that would be great all right, we're coming up on another bridge, it looks like. Oh, that was a really cool little boat ramp area right there. I went ahead and decided to get a uh, cinematic shot of that. Okay, so we're coming up on the road again, it looks like. So we'll have to make a decision which way we're going, which is kind of easy. We're gonna make a right-hand turn out of here. And then we will be back west as the sun is starting to set. All right, 
Let's see. Yep. Right turn here. And we're going to be on the left side of the road, Jeff. Not the right. <laughs> You'd be surprised how, how easy it is to screw that up, you know? All right, Mr. Truck, I see you there. Yeah, sadly, you don't have all Australian trucks, but it's been doing a really good job of getting, you know, that feel of Australia in. There's that guy. Nobody else come from that side. Nope, we're good. Awesome. What is that? Okay. It's water falling. I was like, what is that? Is that rain? Yep, that's definitely rain coming down. For a second, I thought it was like wildlife. I haven't seen any wildlife. I know we added some new wildlife, so that'd be cool to see. Car, I don't know what you're doing, buddy, but you're not going to be making that pass. I was looking for the wipers, and then I looked over to my right mirror. I'm like, what is that car doing besides a death wish? All right, now we're getting up to speed. So, yeah, let me know what you think of the map in the comments below. I know a lot of you guys from Australia are probably excited to see this project coming along the way it has, especially ever since you teamed up with the Australia map stuff. It's just a difference, you know, a huge difference at that. Let's put her in eight high. With the Serial Blacks mod in here, you can, uh, there's already hydroplaning in the game, but man, it, uh, it doesn't mess around, so we gotta watch our speed through here. To this section, actually. See how narrow it is. Let's get a little bit of a window washer right here. Yeah, we know that the road's subject to flooding. That is very apparent. What else? I think some other new things that we didn't see before is all the new markings on the side of the road. Those are all new assets that he added as well. Thank you for letting me know that I'm leveling up. I appreciate it greatly. I mean, we're doing 60 and it's scary <laughs> on, on a wet roadway like this. It is a total different world, man. Been thinking after the new year, I might look into getting a uh, new VR headset. Now I have the Reverb G2, but I kind of want to get the Pimax Crystal, man. It, I mean, what a difference that is for simulation games. I mean, all that stuff's really expensive. It's either I get a G, I want to get a new GPU for the PC, but. And we're not stopping the engine. We're not stopping there. Let's get this thing back up to speed. Let's get back to the speed limit of 62 miles per hour, which is a hundred, probably 100k, 100 kilometers an hour, something like that. An itch on my nose. It's not that. It's not very nice. Oh yeah, it's it's definitely coming down on us now. Now you get a good sense of just how big the map is because the the menu doesn't do it justice. It really doesn't. And this is a, a straight shot down to Cool Addy that has the really cool gas station there. All right, we're at 65. I'm just going to let it coast a little bit here. That's a truck up ahead, but they're in our lane, so nothing to worry about here. It's kind of like, uh, you know how I do it in the US just kind of put the nose of the truck on that left line and you're pretty much right where you need to be in the lane Sounds like a school crossing or something here oh that's my and Detta. okay me and Ditta. that's where we started and we're leveling up like crazy because I have stonks in there <laughs> damn you stonks Woo, big bump yeah, it's a nice, nice, relaxing drive, though. Out here in the middle of nowhere, man. So if you uh, been looking for a mod that'll scratch the itch that is Australian trucking, well, can't go wrong with this stuff, man. You really can't. And we're going to be checking out a couple more mods as well. 
Got another, uh, got another, got two more super liners to show off. So all of our fun is not over yet. Well, this rain's crazy. Here we are just having a jolly old time. Man, driving the outside view is even in a straight line is not the easiest with the bumps on this road. My God, I feel like we're going to die any second. It feels like we're going to die any second. Actually, we're okay, believe it or not. <laughs> I wanted to get a cool outside view of us flying down the road here, but these bumps are no joke, man. Especially on the direct drive wheel. Like, I'm feeling every bump in, in, in this. It is awesome. Never a dull moment out in the outback. Divine champion. I think that's what it keeps saying. You're a divine champion. Did you know? Well, now you do. What does this sign say? We have another turn off up here. Yep, another parking, trucking parking. For the truckies. All right, we gotta watch what we're doing up here. I don't think with the serial black spots, man, you can lock up your tires very easily. I do not have uh, ABS on this truck. Last thing we need to do is that cement truck, you know, to abruptly slow down on us because we would be screwed. So I'm going to back off him a little bit here as we start to head back this direction. I haven't seen any of this yet. And uh, it looks, looks different as well. Like all the new rocks and like, it doesn't even seem like the same map as before. The new markings on the ground, AI cars. It's cool, man. Also, gotta love it whenever you uh, update your windows. Sometimes it resets my Steam, so now I have all the all the pop-ups from Steam now. That's something fun. I gotta go back in. Ooh, we got our rail coming up. Slow down here. I don't see a train. Nope, we're good. Well, that wasn't very bad of a bump, honestly. That could have been way worse. But it wasn't. Car, here, if you want to pass me, just go ahead and pass me, buddy. I'll slow down for you. Nope, you just hit the brakes. Oh, yeah, because there's a truck coming. That's why. Yeah, I wouldn't want to do that either, man. It's not good. I think we still got a long ways to go to get to Cool Eddie, honestly. There they go. They finally passed us. Oh, and they're going to get in front of us and hit the brakes. It's pretty realistic. It's like we have rain on the right side of the road, and then it's like clear on the left. It's just strange. I'm going to slow down a little bit here. Not expecting any rain on this run, but it's a welcome surprise. Oh, Mayfield Station is where we're at. Okay. I don't think I've bought that place yet. Yeah, it's another little ranch there. All right, where is this at? This isn't cool out yet. This is a new road. The one takes you due north. I've been on that road before, I think. And it is, it's, it's, it's fun. It's got like cliffs and stuff. Yeah, I think I've been on that one before. It goes way out, and then you have like a tree in the road. You have to go around. He's going for the overtake. Look at him go. Brave soul. You know what? Actually, we might be able to get the overtake here. 
on the cement truck finally. Uh, it's risky. Might be able to pull it off. We got a grid coming up. Can you imagine hitting a grid at 60 miles an hour? Jeez Louise. Yeah, I don't think I'm getting around this guy just yet. Yeah, that, that would have been death. There's not enough room to get around him. That's for certain. Oh, this is cool. Look at that. We got like a raised road there. I like that. All right, I might be able to get around this guy now. The next straightaway we can see after this truck passes. Well, we should be able to get around him. Maybe. Yeah, we're going to go for it here. Here we go. Hold on to your butts. Passing Mr. Cement. Oi. Bye-bye. All right, now we can get back over. We'll tell them thank you. I don't know they do that in Australia. It's like a, I mean, it's an American thing. Slow back down to 65. Not really worried if we if we get a ticket, it's not the end of the world. I think the rain is starting to die off. That looks to be the case. I'm gonna roll the windows down and just listen to the sounds of trucking here in Australia. Yeah, you saw that uh, cop sitting there. If they are presently like, parked like that, you will get a ticket if you're speeding when you go by them. So we, there's a little bit of engine braking there as that guy was uh, overtaking him. But it's just been a real fun drive today. I, I know we're just hauling empties, but hey, you know what? I've been, I've been meaning to get down to Cool Addy anyway on this profile. So I can start heading out west because the next time I, we got to go check out the Australia map too, you know. I just wanted to show you Rob's first. All right, I thought we were going up a hill, but we're, we're fine now. I need to keep it in seven high. Yeah, I don't see any lights back there, so I think... I don't think there's any traffic directly behind us. I think that car up there was doing another one. Doing another uh, overtake. We gotta be getting close to Cool Addy now. Let's have a look at the map. Zoom out a little bit. So we're past Plum's Farm, it looks like. And I think it's the next, it's probably the next uh, big spot on the map, I'd imagine. That to be the case. Can you believe it's almost Christmas, man? I can't believe it. I really can't. This year flew by. And that's the thing. This year flew by, so I know next year's going to fly by, too. 
And then we'll have GTA 6 before you know it. But yeah, it's hard to believe that, uh, hard to believe it's almost Christmas. You guys got any good Christmas plans? Whoa, damn. That car was ripped in half, dude. Stark reminder that you're out here in the middle of nowhere. Now, I, I did go with the uh, with the in extent, like the massive tanks on this thing, so we have barely used any fuel. I mean, she's designed to go far, you know? Put her down into eight low. Give this guy some more room. I love the additions to the side of the road. I haven't seen any wildlife yet. I'm actually surprised by that. I know he's added a camel. There's camels out here. There's rue. And man, they always scare the hell out of you. They pop out of nowhere. Now you can't hit them or anything, but I mean, you can drive through them. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna try to get around this guy if we can. Let him know I'm coming around him here. Flash my lights at him. Oh, another car destroyed on the side of the road. Big bumps. Okay, he's hitting the brakes for me. That's nice when you see him do that. I don't think that's oncoming traffic. I think that person's just overtaking as well. Yep, we're going to get around this guy. I don't even think road trains can overtake unless somebody's going like super slow. I'm not sure. I don't know the rules of the Aussie roads. But I'm sure y'all will let me know in the comments below. Just maintain the speed with this guy. And that guy behind us was going a lot slower than this one is. We're out here trying to, you know, make it to our destination in one piece. Not the car graveyards on the side. Reminding us how terrible we're driving sometimes. Now, eventually, when we can see like long road trains going by us, that's whenever it would be very immersive. Because that's the craziest stuff. When you watch these truckies do this, and uh, they go, you know, they say you got one that's like four. Four massive tra trailers long at these speeds just whizzing by on these narrow roads. It's crazy. Absolutely crazy. Gotta have your wits about you when you're driving in the outback. Yeah, I'm fine with that right there. Unless we got something coming up here. I think this might be our destination. Just might be it. Yeah, I think we're getting close. It looks like it anyway. And yeah, you my I'm looking at my fuel gauge there. It barely, barely budged off a of full, so not too shabby. This should be the place up here on the right. This is it. Hell yeah. This is what I wanted to do. I wanted a repo all the way over here. Now, we'll probably not get to run these trailers next time. I'm going to look at some other ones um, and see if I can get a run out of Cool Addy, and then we can go out west to check out the Australia map next time. Another dead car on the side of the road there. Oh, another one here. Holy moly. This is such an immersive map, man. Now I have select Patreons that I uh, will go with. Rob's one of those. I uh, do Rob, do Homburg. Uh, Voith? No, I don't do Voith anymore, I don't think. But uh, Hamburg is the one that does the um, coast-to-coast -coast map. 
then Quant 5, NVE, and FT Sim sounds for my flight sims. Those are the big Patreons that I uh, support. But I mean, for a price of, you know, a cup of coffee, here you go. Can be driving in Australia. <laughs> I'm messing with that stupid thing on the right there. Almost took out a damn sign. see if there's any new additions to here because remember last time when we first got here we saw the kangaroo jump into the very end of the road and it was like the, it was the very end of the map there but this is all new so after it so we'll see what is shaking here in the cool of addy slow this puppy up this is an america truck sim normal physics where it's like arcade where you can slam the brakes Actually, I should demonstrate it though, with the speed that we have and, and just how uh, how fast we're going. If I lock the brakes up, what it sounds like, I'll demonstrate it for you. Did you hear that squeal? <laughs> That's crazy, dude. Very crazy. But I just wanted to show it to you. Showcase it a little bit. See, now this is right. You go to the left. Oh, there's Kangaroo down there. Nice. This is the truck entrance. You go over here so you can swing your whole truck over to the right in this spot. That's the correct way to do it. Roll our window down so we can look outside here. Yep, there's them Kangaroo jumping around out there. Mike be okay here. Nope. Got another one coming. Another one coming. Just gotta watch for those shadows. Oh, hello, buddy. Got the doubles going on there. Another one. Holy crap. Where's this traffic coming from? Okay, we're good. Oh, there's a truck coming. He sees us there, right? Yeah, he sees us. Don't mind me, buddy. Sorry. Yeah, there's the little fox trap there. We're gonna come in here and turn around. It looks pretty much the same around here from what I remember it as. I'm not sure what's all new over that way. But we're just going to park this bad boy up over here by this ute and other truck. And there we have it. Let's park it up right here for now. Let's kill the engine and welcome to cool Addy. You know, we wanted to check out the Ute. So there it is right there in all its glory. What a fun drive that was. So now we're staged to go West next time to check out the Australia map. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments below. I'll see you guys next time. Take care.